good morning guys hi beautiful hi handsome so i know i've been gone for quite a while like i just disappeared i haven't posted since i haven't posted this year but i post last year maybe can't remember when i did but anyway story time spilling the teas not all of it but how have you guys been how are you dealing with the covid situation and having you guys taking your vaccine if you are gonna take any but anyway i'm here i've been gone for quite a while i'm gonna tell you what i'm up to what's been going on what i've changed and stuff like that and i'll also be doing a makeup look as well because i think i'm going out for a little bit so i'm just gonna do my makeup i get ready with my one time video so let's get into it i'm so happy to see you guys i hope you're excited to see me as well and that you miss me because i really miss you guys i try to post some stuff but sometimes i'm just not motivated to or just not in the mood or i'm just not up to it so i miss you guys so let's get into it i see you in a while okay bye There you are, so long time, long, long, long time, long, long, long time. So yeah, so I'm gonna be attempt. I'm gonna attempt to do my makeup at the same time while I talk to you guys. So let's get into it. So last year I posted and I did not really post back for the rest of the year not even a christmas video guys i was in the process of moving and it was very 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 difficult um time for me last year during the pandemic i was just like homework 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 everything was just home and work for me last year so i already did my eyebrows offline so i'm just going to be using my stiffy um foundation makeup by Maybelline and this is supposed to stay yeah did I say stay free? did I say stay free? yeah I think I did so um I was moving from where I was first because the distance was too far for me and it was just too far traveling back and forth from there to get to work and to get the kids to school and everything like that. But anyway, I'm going to close to town to everything. It's more convenient for me here and time called time it is the best time. I wanted to move before Christmas so I could have decorated and had blogs for Christmas like and stuff like that. But I didn't get all of that done because I didn't move. At that time in Christmas I was already packed, everything was already packed and they just had to be there waiting to be taken away. But um here yeah, now it's not fully complete there, but I have a lot of things to get done and stuff to get in. But I'm waiting on God's timing. I'm waiting to see what he's gonna do for me because I know he's gonna do something. So I'm just After rest as well, and I was still doing little um, tutorials and stuff. I stopped taking care of my skin, I stopped flaming when I'm taking care of my skin. I was just so, 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 so depressed and not motivated to do anything because I just feel like I can't do it anymore and I just can't because I was not in a place where I wanted to be. I feel like I was living in someone else's body and someone else's world. So but I am getting there. I will not be telling all of the teas as yet but you guys things have not been the same but thank god i am alive and well there's so many people i see passed away last year and this year as well and i'm so like oh my god thank you for giving me 
But anyway, I've been coming back slowly, taking care of myself, and I've been just trying to just take care of everybody else and just leaving myself, neglecting myself, not taking care of myself, not having time for myself and stuff like that. But I've been making sure that everybody else was okay. And sometimes you just can't do it anymore. Sometimes you just gotta know when to stop. You gotta know when to go. So I'm just gonna use my mirror and just let it see what I'm gonna do. So sometimes you just gotta get up, you just gotta see you can't do this anymore. You gotta take care of yourself first. You gotta make sure that you're okay first. And that's what I've been doing lately. Like a couple months, like almost three months now, we can get on me. I've been doing it. I've been setting me up for before I get anybody else set up. I've been trying to fix me. I've been depressed. I just feel like giving up on everything else because things was not going the way I wanted to. Wanted it to go at time, the pace of everything was just slow. But I learned to be patient and to accept things for what they are. So I need to do that. And I want to just love myself for who I am. Somebody else loved me this way. And I'm gonna just forget about everything else. But if I slumber my words or shatter my words or whatever, just wear it to me. I'm just not, I'm not nervous because I've never been nervous in front of the camera or around anybody or an audience or whatever. I'm not, I've not been nervous. I'm just a bit disappointed. Because you make plans and they don't come to you. They don't come to you. They don't give you enough yourself. You don't give you enough energy. You know, like say, oh my god, it's the thing. Things ever gonna happen to me. And I'm not gonna get where I want it to get what. Don't give up. You still have to keep on pushing it. Right? Push, 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 push. It's like you get what you do. So that's what I want. Don't forget to always do your neck in because my neck is black and my face is like long black. Don't smile it. I'm not bleaching my skin or anything. I love me for me. I love my color. I love my complexion. I'm a black princess and a black beauty. So love your own skin. Some people don't wear makeup because they say, oh, makeup is this and makeup is that. Makeup kind of everything else. But makeup just enhances your beauty. You are already beautiful in outside and I'm here for the woman. Like you're really beautiful. You don't need it to make you more beautiful, you understand me? But you wanna wear it? You don't wanna wear makeup, it's okay. You don't wanna wear it? It's okay. You wanna wear it is still so I just taking it simple. Uh my work has been okay. I've been loving my work. I actually am a workaholic. I love to work. I don't want to be at home and depend on anybody, which I will don't do because you're not supposed to. I love to be independent. At the end of the day, nobody can show themselves on me and say I'm not independent or anything like that. So. You have to be independent. You have to show people that you got what it takes in this world where right now you don't need a man. You don't have to have a man if you don't have one. You don't need to go out looking for a man if you don't have a man. You understand me? So I'm just gonna use this um, this LA um, eye pencil thing brush so just to brush my concealer together um the concealer that I was using was pro, pro concealer by Elite Girl and it is in the color Tuffy it's in the color Tuffy so yeah so I've just 
been focusing on me lately. I've gave people opportunities too much to break my heart, to break me. And I got disappointed because I expected too much from people and in turn I did not get what I truly deserve. I've helped people who turn their backs on me and gossip behind my back and say all sorts of evil things about me like I've been through that I've helped people like these days people are so selfish when you can't help them anymore they don't really study you they just want you and you can help them I'm just putting a little bit um, on my eyelid for whenever I put my shadow yeah so I've been helping people and they have not been showing me no appreciation in return but God knows I'm a good person I'm going to still continue helping people and stuff because that's who I am you can't let people change you and situation change you because the more I help I feel like God is helping me some other way he's doing something beyond this beyond the scene that I cannot see but he is doing it so i have not given up on anybody i try not to have any enemies to be honest there is no enemy that i know of right now <laughs> um yeah there is none that i know of if we are not speaking or you think i'm not speaking to you it's not because I, we have a problem or we um there is anything wrong. It's just me. I'm just been busy. I've just been doing my work. I've just been trying to get me back to my happy place again. It's not easy. It's not easy. Oh my god, it's not easy. I'm not crying, but I'm just trying to get this thing up. But it's not being busy, but I try to just take it one step at a time. And see what God has in store for me. You know, God has done in store for everybody. You know, we just have to trust His timing. And lately, I've been dealing with issues from past, like uh, people is coming and telling me, "Oh, this and that, or whatever." Like this, I'm not this gossiping, and I'm not into it that much. Like I want to hear what people are saying, but I don't really care. What people say about you, you don't take their tags and deliver your stuff. You just carry your thing. You don't have to wear the tags that people do. So I've got a few different things. I have a follow up with my friend um, last year and she has been my friend for so long. But we are okay now. She's there for me. To my skin, so we have fallen out. <laughs> um, we didn't really cause cause cause, but you know, sometimes I just feel like I just want people to be honest with me and just tell me there's a situation and it's making you uncomfortable and you don't like it. Let's let me know so that I can fix my behavior towards that situation so that I won't make anybody feel uncomfortable because I love to make people uncomfortable about me. Loved ones. I'm here and then back home somebody died. I can't go to the funeral. I've been thinking about my good my grandma, good friend that passed away. She was she was like she's like family. And she passed away and I couldn't be there for the funeral but I did want to go guys, all the guys in my village that had passed away and I 
did not get to go. I had family members that passed away and I did not get to go. That was a bit um, hard for me. Yeah, it was very, very difficult. I couldn't go because I love funerals. Like, I had a lot of funerals in my life where I go to funerals and stuff like that. But, um, yeah. And then I wanted to go and see my grandmother this year for her birthday because she's not getting younger, she's getting older. And, yeah, I wanted to go and make sure she's okay and just spend time with her. The last time I went was 2019, I think, to visit. I think 2019 or 18. 2019, I went to. And she was okay. I had not spent the time that I should have because I had to come back for work, you know. But I take care of her, make sure that she's okay and she. She was happy to see me, so but at least I wanted to go. But the COVID situation right now is just getting out of hand. So, um, hopefully, by the uh, end of the year, everything is now done. I can come and visit her. So, I'm gonna just be using the previous um, place, the Numbian Blue Palette, is the only one that came with the set of the that I got last year. So, I just take it out of this bag. These are the I'm just gonna tell you about the lipids as well. So, so, yeah. So, I did not get to go this year for her birthday, but she's gonna have an enjoyable birthday. I'm gonna pray to God that I keep her alive and safe and well until I see her again. God is so good. Uh, this year, for one of my challenges for me is reading my Bible every day. I want to be getting into it every day, but sometimes I really don't because um, I have other things to do. I have work and then I have to take care of my kids and other responsibility that I have to take care of. Is that my brush showing? That's not cute. So I had a responsibility that I had to take care of. Yeah, so she's gonna be okay. God is gonna see her too so that I can get to see my journey. So um let me see. They don't really have any names at the bottom so I can tell you what color and shade that I'm using. So I think I'm gonna use this orange one here in the middle. So let's go with that one. So so she's gonna be okay. God is gonna spare her life for me to get to see her. And I go down to visit. Um, courage, but I'm still working on what I really want to do. But I really, really know what I want to do, and that is being in a medical field. So this year, definitely, it's not going to be passing me. I'm just going to be getting things, the ball rolling and getting it done. So I'll give you updates when I'm totally enrolled in my medical field and my studies and stuff like that. Um, yeah, but the kids are okay. They are growing up. <sighs> my daughter drives me crazy. She's just fine and she drives me crazy. She's very stubborn. I guess that's from her mom. That's from me. She's too stubborn for me sometimes. I just can't handle her sometimes. But she's very, very intelligent. She's doing well at school. At this time, it's so um, homeschooling since. Um, this year since February they um not going to school but they're doing school online but she's getting there and she's very smart just me she's miserable she's so stubborn I have to talk to her a hundred times for her to just hear me out she stresses me out so so much but she's a good girl but she's just so stubborn just like, no, but 
I want her to get rid of the stubbornness. Because I can't handle her being stubborn. And I'm being stubborn. And I'm already crazy already. So <laughs> she gotta stop stressing me out. So, yeah. So, this one is this. Yeah. I can see the color. It's coming out. It's pretty right. Yeah, but they're okay. My church is not really functioning like 100%, like it's online. Um, so, most of the time I go online and listen to my church because you have to make like, you have to let them know if you want to attend service because, like, for now, because of the COVID situation here, we're just letting 25 people go into service. No, right now and then your mask then you gotta keep your hands clean and wash your hands so that is where we are now we just go to the situation so um we're getting there slowly i pray every day when i said nobody else can take away this COVID-19 more than god and he will know how to intervene he's just letting us go into our bible speak and do what we're supposed to do coming together making things better and giving him all the praise and talent despite of the situation that we are going through i feel like i'm speaking very soft but i hope that i am not because i wanted to hear what i'm saying so that's where things are you know so i've been going online and doing my own service because i want to stay connected to god at all times in good time i should be staying Good, bad, and good time. We should be staying connected with God at all time. Yay! So, let's just bring this to the side a little bit over here. So, yeah. so how have you guys been doing? Have you guys taken your vaccine? Um, I'm a little bit skeptical about it because you're hearing so much things that the vaccine does not. Why are we gonna take it? It's not gonna prevent us from getting the virus. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna take it. I'm just praying to God that should I take it or should I not take it? Yeah, I know for some people that are asked, some older folks than me, they have pressure, sugar, and other problem. They're just scared to wonder if um, it will make complications worse for them when they take the vaccine. It's gonna something to their body you know everybody reacts everybody body reacts differently to medication to different stuff so I might take it and totally fine you in another case might take it and you're not totally doing good so let's see about that so if I do take my I will come back and give you an update of uh, something like that or you can always tell me in one of my comments you can connect to me on Facebook and Instagram, TikTok, I'm on TikTok, it's not going to be because I don't really understand TikTok too much, but TikTok is like just the TikTok, TikTok, but you know, um, it's getting there. So if you take it, let me know if you take it. So I'm just going to be looking for a, um, a glitter color here, but I think I'm gonna be using so I already use this one the orange color so I'm just gonna be using this orange glitter one yeah so you can tell me if you take the vaccine at home been going on. how it's affecting you if it's working or if you're having any symptoms or any side effect to the vaccine I don't know but I have a lot of people Who's my friend and do I already taking it but I have not taken it until I think I'm waiting on maybe God to tell me to take it. <laughs> yes, I'm probably I'm waiting on him to tell me to go and take it. Mm. This is so pretty. It was like was brighter, it would have been so pretty. I don't want to play play play. So I'm just putting a little bit of glitter over it. Oh my gosh. Guys, have you seen this glitter? It's beautiful. So, 
If you take it, let me know. If I take it, I'll come back and tell you. Give a little update on how um how it is. If it's bothering me. But yeah. So lately, besides all my stress and being discouraged and not motivated, I've been giving a lot of advice to a lot of people to to my WhatsApp and stuff like that. I've made new friends. <laughs> I love friends. I've made new friends, meet new people. And for me, it's just, they just want, they just talk to me and they like how I talk to them. And I give them really good advice and they just stick to me. Everything now is just calling me. Hey, I want to know this. I want to know that. What should I do in this situation? And I feel blessed to have to be in this process right now. Because I get to help people. You understand me? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna put a little bit of orange. A little bit of more orange here. Yeah. So, so that is what I've been doing. Yeah. So lately, I've been given out of advice. I have this one. I've a finish a metal family and stuff like that. And I'll be helping her along the way to tell her it's okay. It's okay, it's gonna be okay and you don't get everything you want whenever you want it because sometimes we might want something and it's really not for us. But God timing is the best. So I'm just telling her to wait on God, let God decide what he wants. He's the guy, he's the big man in this situation. You just relax yourself now and let God work for you. You understand me? And let God, God just work for her. And he's gonna see her through. So we just use the glitter one over the block, the um, the orange one. I mean. So now I'm just gonna go up a little more closer, like here. And just cover it with the orange one. So you can actually see how beautiful these palettes are. How pretty it is. So, uh, so, so I've been giving her advice as well. She's become like my best friend now. Everyone's my best friend. But she's become my good friend right now she's like a sister to me. I think I was my sister because you know she is she's texting me right now yeah but <laughs> I get back to her in a while baby so she's very nice she's very pretty very very pretty girl I tell all women they are beautiful and I only don't say it because I want them to feel good but it's not true. The truth, they are beautiful. So I've been giving the first advice you know, into this year. I have not really said anything that I wanted to get done yet. But deep down in my heart, I know I have to start getting more rolling. Because I'm not getting any younger. Please. I'm not getting any younger. I'm getting, actually, I'm getting older. I'm getting older and. I just need to know what I want at this time while I get old. Yeah, so I have to know what I want at this time. So I'm just gonna be using my black opera um super value mascara my lashes. Um, for the lashes that I'm using, it's just from Adair Lashes, just normal lashes. I just pick up on my random beauty store, which is Beauty Rama. Yeah, and they have all the beautiful stuff that you need. Yeah, you should check it out. Here, here. So, I uh, think this eyeshadow is finished. Yeah, so I'm just gonna put some mascara. It's very inexpensive, and it does add a lot of to your eye, your 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 eyelashes. Yeah, you 
these are like this this for me this is the best I just need a little bit you see a little bit goes long way look at this creature right so I have been just taking one step at a time one step at a time and seeing what can be done so I'm just gonna be using a little um, automatic eyeliner in the color black just to make a little bit of green or whatever attempt to make wings. So yeah. So she's like Come on, sister, to me right you now. I give her advice, she gives me advice, she's been there for me, and I've been there for her as well. So, it's all good. So, um, I've been cooking something, going to be in the kitchen more. I'm cooking a lot more and seeing what can I do. So for the first time I cook shrimp, garlic shrimp, with sweet pepper, onion, tomato, a lot of garlic because it's garlic shrimp. So I've been doing that and it came out very, 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 very nice. And I've been trying to eat healthy, trying to do some weight as well. And stuff like that. Mm -hmm. So God has been good. I can't complain about his greatness towards me. Even when I messed up, he has shown me that he's a forgiving God and he will always forgive and he but we can't just do it because you always forgive me have to know. Want to stop, actually stop. Not because he's a forgiving God, we will just keep doing, keep messing up. And say, no, he's a forgiving God, he's gonna forgive me. No walk okay? So just a close up. Yeah, cute. For my lips, I'm gonna be trying. I'm gonna be using the Grabber Lip Balm by Julia Space. If you guys have not um, have one of these, I then you can get your hand with it. Please do because it smells nice and. It's not expensive either. So I hope you guys have, have been spending wise because our hours from work has been cut and our salary has not been dropped just in our hours. Yeah, our salary has been dropped because if our hours cut, then our salary is going to be cut as well. So this is how it looks outside of the box. Very pretty, very shiny. So, I'm still gonna be wearing a mask, but still wanna get my lips. But I don't feel like adding any colors to it to my lips, so I'm just gonna be using. The smell is unbelievable. So, uh, my skin routine has not been really changed, although I had stopped um, taking care of my skin. So just maybe two weeks ago or three weeks ago, I have started taking care of my skin. I have not really got any new product to use on my skin, just a little bit. I start using the Ambe, Ambe um, Complexion Soap to clear up my skin, make it more um, shiny and more natural looking and stuff like that. I've been using my scrubber still 
on my face my nighttime skin care routine has not been changed i have not taken any out anything out or put in anything just leave it the same way guys this smells so good so it's just a natural look should i add color it has so i'm just gonna comb my hair this wig i had i got it for my brother last year as well very nice but I have not really made it in care that much. And I have just been wearing it not even to the fullest potential. But I've just been wearing it so so I'm just coming back slowly but surely. I'm just coming back. I hope you guys are washing your hands and keeping your distance if you don't have to be around people don't go yeah don't go my face is not free because i'm not putting my products here my setting powder if you don't have to go around people don't go because it's for your safety and you have to protect who's in your home you understand so if you don't have to go outside if you hear the ambulance that's a regular thing here every day because I live close to the road, don't mind it. Every day you just hear this thing. And it scares me like, what's going on? It's, um, it's there, they're going for somebody. Or somebody dropped down or whatever. But it's going on every day you hear it. So, if you don't have to go to anywhere where there's a gathering, please don't go. Okay, please don't go. I'm telling you. The more you steal from people, you're gonna feel more secure and you're gonna feel more better when you know your limit when you know your setup. And if you have not got tested for the um COVID as yet, it is very easy. Just go to your health care place and ask them about how to get tested for your to know your COVID status. It's always a good thing to know. Okay. So keep washing your hands, keep washing your hands, keep your mask on. I don't have my mask on. I don't have no worry about this thing. Okay, make sure if you're wearing um, your mask to wash them. And if you're wearing the surgical mask, just you can wash them too. Maybe use them two or three times and wash them. You gotta be safe as well. Wash your hands, stay away from the crowd, stay away from the people. You know, it's hard to do that because we are so accustomed to the norm, like going out with our friends, hanging out and stuff like that. But it's not, it's not now, it's not the best time to risk anybody's life. So, so I'm just going to be using, um, it's by Artistic, absolutely new. York um it's the HD flawless setting powder in the color bright banana so if you don't have to go outside um, don't go because it's not safe right now for me I don't have to go anywhere I'm going to the shop the supermarket to the gas station and back home I gotta protect my kids, I gotta put on myself, I, gotta, I have to protect my co-worker. So if you don't have to go anywhere, don't go. If you guys see the lace, I just put this thing on and do not stick it or anything, okay? It's a lace. So. If you don't have to go anywhere, please don't go. Yeah, so guys, I'm just going out to the corner. So I'm show you. I want to start doing a fitness video where I show you how I exercise. I to exercise. You understand? I'll be doing that as well. I'll be doing a closet. Um, a closet tour. 
of me organizing my closet and cleaning out and giving away things I no longer need, no longer wear. Oh, so, because sometimes we all have a lot of things in there and we don't wear it, and there are so many people we don't really have to wear. You know, let's give it up. God is going to bless you 10 times over. testimony of that he's gonna bless you more than you even deserve you know so that's where I have been as I said I'm in my new home it's not finished yet with everything I need to get in it but it's a start you understand so I'm grateful for the process that which which um, which I have, I'm thankful for the people who are in my life right now. It's not a bad of roses, it's not so Everything is going to go okay with it, but it's getting the way. So, thank you for stopping by. If you have not subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? It's going to get better, just give it time, just let your girl go. You have friends in your house, let them subscribe to my channel and they want to get it because I'll be talking about that thing here. You guys know it's so funny when I'm ready, I'm cracking jokes. You guys will be laughing. So, I do love skincare, I do love makeup, I do love a clean house. I'll show you how I clean my stove, how to do this, how to, easy way of to get things done. If you see how things are difficult, I'll show you easy way of how to get it done. So, please subscribe, share, comment. Let me know what you want to see on my next YouTube video. Um, if you want to go outside, you want to see outside, whatever you want to see, just let me know. If you have any advice for me or if you have any question, leave it down in the comment box. Or you can follow me on Instagram, on TikTok, on Facebook. You know, just send little messages and tell me, hey, blah, blah, blah. I'm here to listen. I'm always here. So, ladies, you stay beautiful. The guys, you stay handsome. And just keep safe. Don't give up on you because nobody else is going to like push you like how you push you. So, make sure that you are getting you done first. Because I'm telling you, I've been neglecting myself for months now and I can't do it anymore. It's not who I want to be. And it's not me. So, I'll see you in the next video. Much love and appreciation. Yeah, I look warm, right? You guys want to see different makeup look? Let me know. Yeah, this is cute, though. Yeah, this is nice. So, bye. Take care.